okay guys so we got some types of drawings related to street and this is pcc street okay having length equals 200 meters and the breadth equals 3 meters but over here here is some types of extension which is 2 meters and this is making this portion is uh, trapezium okay all right in the plan okay and here are drains longitudinal and uh, these three are transverse okay and uh, these drawings are kind of uh, cross section and long section all right and let's say we are asked to estimate pcc for the given street it's so simple there is nothing complicated to her it is all about a uh, volume all right so i'll come directly into the solution and in the solution as you can see we are asked to work out pcc it must be in form of volume okay and the volume or the total pcc of the street can be the covered area times the thickness this uh, formula is just the same thing for all types of works okay in order to calculate the volume here is we are just working the volume or the pcc so it must be the area times the thickness or you can say the covered area times the thickness all right here the main thing we gonna calculate is the covered area and i'm gonna just convert this plan into three portions like as you can say uh like this one okay from the start to this portion where the extension is uh, starting okay and then this portion which is a trapezium and at the end this is a rectangle all right so 80 times 3 this is the area of the first portion you can say area of the third portion i'm gonna say which is 60 times 3 all right and then the area of this trapezium portion and this must be 3 plus 5 divided by 2 or you can say the uh, the average of these two parameters and times the height like it's gonna say 3 okay 3 meters plus 5 meters divided by 2 which is the of course uh, the average of two parameters the bottom end in the above one and then times the height this time as you can see the height is 60 meters so this is the total covered area of the street times the thickness and it is given okay as you can see in the cross section it is 30 centimeters or you can say 0 0.3 meters okay so times 0 0.3 meters now do little mathematics with this like as you can say v equals the total area or the covered area this must be 660 square meters times the thickness again and then the volume which is the total volume okay we have not detect anything yet and it is 198 cubic meters the volume is in cubic meters okay because all parameters are given in the meters all right now we're gonna detect these drains okay because uh, this is the the total volume not the net volume we're gonna detect these drains so we can get of course the net volume so let's go ahead for the detection of drains and uh, i'm gonna calculate the volume of drain and it is the same thing okay the cross sectional area times the length okay as you can see this one it is a drain okay this is the longitudinal drain and these are the transverse drains the threes okay the dimension or the size of both types of drains are just the same okay as you can see 9 times 20 centimeters and this little portion it is 6 centimeters okay as you can see just over here this one all right so cross sectional area times the length the volume of the drain equals the cross sectional area that is given 9 times 20 is okay centimeter but we're gonna convert this into meters like 9 centimeter equals 0 0.09 meters okay times 20 centimeters or you can say 0 0.2 meters now the length it is the main problem okay we're gonna calculate length separately like length of the longitudinal drain that is given okay which is 200 meters so it's so simple but over here we have problem in the drain which are in the transverse direction all right and that must be of course the breadth of the street which is three meters minus the breadth or the weight of the drain you can say which is of course nine centimeters or 0 0.09 meters okay and as you can see uh, we have another portion like this one six centimeters okay left over here as you can see this one this portion okay so three meters minus this weight of the drain minus that this little uh, portion and that is 0 0.06 meters all right now as you can see this is length of the uh, single drain and we have three drains so we're gonna multiply these guys with three so we can get of course the length of the transverse 
drain per oil equals 8.55 meters okay and it is total which is 200 plus 8.55 meters so the total length must be 208.55 meters and we're gonna put this video over there in the above formula okay which is the volume of the drain and it must be of course 3.7539 cubic meters that's it this is the volume of the drain or volume of all drains now we're gonna calculate net PCC work which is going to be the total PCC work minus this deduction for the drains like total PCC work that is given 198 cubic meters minus the deduction and it's been calculated just few seconds ago so the net PCC works equals 194.2461 cubic meters and that's it it was so simple okay there is nothing complicated over here so that's it hey if you like these types videos please hit that subscribe button press the bell icon and never miss an update from engineer boy thank you dears for watching see you next time